Welcome to the Windows Computer and Technology channel. And if you have installed today's uh, update preview that um, Windows 11 24H2 has received, and like I said in my video where I talk about it, if you don't have any problems or don't care about new features, you can just wait as sometimes they're buggy and will actually be fixed by the time they are installed automatically on patch Tuesday of August. There's a new option that we were talking about that has to do with um, the um, a new feature Microsoft wanted to push to help us uh, with uh, crashing PC, maybe after an update, maybe you've installed a new driver, doesn't want to start. Well, if you go into your Windows updates, go into the advanced options, go into the recovery options, you'll see that there's now something called quick machine recovery. It says if your device fails to start, we'll try to fix a problem with the device recovery solution. And you can turn it on here. And then there's also another option when you turn this on, which is continue searching if a solution isn't found. Select how often your device searches for a solution uh, and restarts. So if you turn this on, you can uh, see here it says we'll look for a solution every 30 minutes or restart every uh, 180 minutes, which is three hours. And of course, you have all the options here to choose what you want in these options. So this has to do with the uh, ongoing problem that was uh, with the uh, CrowdStrike uh, antivirus and that it crashed so many PCs. And if this would have existed, PCs would have restarted with a fix and would have been okay within minutes. Uh, it's an automatic solution, which means that what it does is it connects to, uh, if, your, if your PC crashes, it will connect through the quick machine recovery option to Microsoft servers. And we'll try to find a way to fix the problem because it's gonna send a diagnostics of what went wrong, why does the PC not start, and it will try to fix it if it's a bad driver, if it's something that can be fixed remotely, it will be done. So this is to help make your PCs uh, more resilient, your PCs fixing themselves. That's, I think, a good idea. And it's now available. So if you install today's update, it will be available to you. If not, you won't see this option. And if you don't install anything, it should be available starting the Patch Tuesday updates of August 2025. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.